A popular Portland food cart pod now has a new home. Yeah, the 30 vendors from the Alder Street food cart pod now have a new home on the blocks that are around Ankeny Square, not too far from their old spots. The pod, you may recall, was dismantled to make way for a new high-rise hotel. But the move has not been easy for everyone. Fox 12's Zach Anders explains how some are struggling to make the change work. Food carts throughout the area are still struggling to make that a change from the former site they were at at the Alder Street location taken by the Ritz Carlton development. And as one owner tells us, that change has been tough to adjust to. Danny Chan left Alder Street at the beginning of the month to make way for the new development, hoping to be able to find success elsewhere. His food cart, Sumo Sushi, found a spot to set up on the Portland State University campus. But with classes out for the summer, he says business Business is much lighter here than where they were before. Danny's down to one cart. His second is in storage with about a dozen others in this post office parking lot. The space was donated to the vendors while they wait to find a new home. It's helped, but for Danny, there's still a lot of uncertainty. And it's kind of been emotional time uh, with me. I have a kid on the way. It's going to be coming anytime soon. Um, so I'm kind of nervous there and um, emotional at the same time. How many employees do you have? Uh, how many employees did I have? <laughs> uh, so, oh yeah, I, I did. I mean, there, it's break time, you know, I don't have work for them, so they understand what's going on. Danny had to let two people go. Now it's just him and one other employee. Today, Danny learned a spot just three blocks from their former location had been made available by the city for them to use. But it'll take time and funds to get the new site surrounding Ankeny Square ready for business. In the meantime, Danny tells us he's considering trying to find somewhere else off campus to move his food cart. But as anyone will tell you, it's not easy to find real estate downtown. Reporting in Portland, Zach Anders, Fox 12, Oregon.